What's to you two fam? It's your girl TK and look, you know me. I'm out here car vlogging as usual. You are not going to believe what I just see in the news y'all. Oh, I am like, like appalled. I cannot believe it. And if you are a blogger or if you are somebody who is a consider a content creator and you're talking about governors, senators, people that work in like, you know, an authoritarian role and you want to report on the things that you see or you want an opinion about something, guess what they're trying to say now? Uh-uh pump your brakes we'll put your ass on something similar to like a probation you know if you want to talk about us if you want to report on us guess what you gonna have to do get what yeah get what you gonna have to uh, um you're gonna have to come in monthly and tell us what you're doing or you're going to you know what let me read this bill to y'all so the uh, guy, his name is Florida Senator Jason Brodier, and he's from Lake Mary. And it says that um, Jason proposes that bloggers who write about governor like Governor Ron DeSantis, Attorney General Ashley Moody, and other members of the Florida Executive Cabinet or legislator to register with the state or face fines. Are you at your mother fudge your mind? You're meaning to tell me if you have an opinion, that's called the... um. Con well, that's in the Constitution, baby. Um, according to Amendment Number Uno, Number One, <laughs> that is the right to free speech. If you don't have the ability to speak about um situations, well, guess what? Just go what? Just get what? That means you don't have the right to uh, free speech. That means what they're trying to do now is censor your speaking. They don't want you to talk at all, darling. Oh my gosh, this stuff that goes around Governor DeSantis and what they want regarding DeSantis is sickening. Like, I don't know if y'all realize that, like, this bill, it's a, it's, okay, let me tell you what this bill is now. Now, um, the bill is called Senate Bill 1316, and it's called Information Disinformation. Dissemination. Hopefully I said that right correctly because y'all know your sis, she could get a little tongue twisted. And it basically goes on and it says it will require any blogger writing about governor, government officials to sh register with the Florida Office of Legislative Services or the Commission on Ethics. And it in the bill, Broder wrote that those who write an article, a story, or a series of stories about the governor, the lieutenant governor, a cabinet officer or any member of the legislator and receive or will receive payment for doing so must register with state offices within five days after the publication of any article that mentions an elected state official child they talking about the payment not dwelly the payment you know that's kind of sickening you know that is a really sickening sickening because at this point um basically um, if you're telling um, um, bloggers that they can't report, you're telling news reporters that they can't report anything either. So basically what they're trying to do out here in these streets, y'all, is censor. The word of today is censor, and they want to censor the fuck out of you. And it's sad, it's sickening, it should not be happening. But this is the America that we're living in today. You know, they want to censor what you say. And it is kind of sad. It's really, this is the sadness that we have to deal with in the streets. That's why it's so important, y'all, that you pay attention to what's going on in your area, your community. Because again, like, this bill is outrageous. It should not be occurring. But guess what it's doing? It's occurring, boo. It's out here and it's occurring. Hold on, let me cut this light on so y'all can see me before I hang up this call. Uh, this, uh, <laughs> this, uh, what is this this video girl god whoever watching my video at this time it's this bill is ridiculous it's ridiculous it should not be in effect but this is the bullshit we have to go through y'all anyhow i want y'all to stay prayed out here prayed up out here because if you have an opinion and um, you can actually put those facts together with your opinion. They seriously want you to be censored. They seriously don't want you to have an opinion. They seriously want to monitor. And now they're seriously talking about putting you on probation. And that is seriously a problem. That seriously should not be occurring. This is the seriousness that we are dealing with in today's society. It is very much so serious. 
anyhow guys um i'm i'm about to you know go ahead on with my day i just wanted to go over this article that i saw and i wanted to share that with y'all and look at my little ugly ass i am going the wrong motherfucking way or at least it looked like i am anyhow i'm, I'm gonna go ahead on with my day y'all like ah the the I guess we have to deal with censorship. Look, y'all, I have a, a community tab. Y'all can always reach me on my community tab. Um, y'all, I'm going to put this information on my community tab just in case you guys want to follow up on what I was saying. You will see it. The Senate bill, which I have already, you know, went over with you guys will be on my community tab. Also, you guys can reach me on Instagram. Y'all know your good sis got an Instagram. I call myself deleting everybody off of Instagram like I was cray cray. But that's okay because you know what? I decided, you know what? I'm not going to hang it up. I'm not going to hang up my Instagram. It's going to stay up, y'all. And if you want to add me on Instagram so we know it's real, child, add your good sis on Instagram. My Instagram is TK um, knows K N O W L E S 01. So add your friend on instagram so i know it's real purple and with that being said y'all peace love and happiness y'all stay blessed stay safe and mind y'all business but pay attention to these policies procedures laws rules and regulations that might affect you and your local area